Hey, how you doing again? This is Valentino Marquez from VW Aircraft Society. Uh, I believe this is when I'm going to be posting the video. I was going to post it on my personal channel on YouTube, which is just Valentino Marquez. But, you know, I think it, this is more geared towards, uh, you know, sport bikes and um, people who ride, who, you know, have, you know, some of those sports cars or, you know, even doom buggies and or air cooled BWs probably be more in tune with watching one of these videos. But you never know. Maybe I'll load it to both channels. I have five, five other channels. Different business that I that I own. Okay, I wanted to uh, post this review of a boot that I purchased. Uh, it's a company in the UK called Pro First. Okay, they've been selling these like hotcakes. You know, they just uh, uh, back in December they were selling for about a hundred and ten, one hundred fifteen dollars, one hundred forty dollars. You know, um, some of the some companies have sold them for a lot less, you know, like one hundred four dollars, one hundred five dollars, somewhere I don't know about that. And now, uh, and they've been selling. They, they've been selling out. Okay, it's a, uh, it's a boot, you know, which is a, a, a pretty good, comfortable price, under one hundred and fifty dollars. And I purchased it on Amazon. Okay, for eighty one dollars. What's the difference between these and the other ones, the Power Gear Motorsports that I that I uh, uh, that I was able to review? A big difference. You know, it's not as fancy schmancy with all the red and the plastic and all that good stuff, you know, which I really didn't care for. I, I ride a 2007 Triumph Speed Triple, which is black and gold. Um, I needed somewhere more along the lines that would be closer to adhere to the color scheme that I have on my motorcycle. And um, uh, let me show you this boot. This is called the Pro First Boot. It comes out of the UK, pro-first.co.uk, okay? Uh, I see, you know, you see the Harley Davidsons out here, you know, uh, street street bikes. But it, this boot is actually I geared more towards a sport bike rider. Okay, and here you have it. It's a pro first boot. What I like about this boot is not uh, it doesn't have all that fancy smancy all those horns and whistles that you find in the other boot, you know, the power gear uh, mo motorsports bike. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, boot. I like this one better. Uh, this one actually fit a little better, even though it's a size 11, I was able to wear it with a compression sock, you know, uh, thin enough, and it felt very comfortable on the inside. I'm going to show you some of the features of this of this boot. Uh, here it is, the Pro First. I, didn't, I haven't even removed the tag yet. It came in fresh from Amazon, um, which I ordered on, and it was $81. I'm going to show you the price on here. I see it's on my phone. Okay, let's see if you can see the price, if it could, fo it could somehow focus. Yep, there it is, $81, right? You see it, 81, what is it, $81.99. Okay, I received it in a matter of, uh, I think it was like two to three weeks or so. I think it was two, two weeks. Came, came in uh, and I was very pleased with the, with the boot. Uh, what this has, it has a toe slider, okay? It has a protective uh, here for the, for the shifter pedal, okay? It's got the protection on the sides for your ankles. Okay, uh, it's pretty flexible on here, but not as flexible. You know, it's, it's somewhat rigid. Rigid. It's got an accordion type uh, material on here. It's also uh, noted as a leather boot. Okay, and uh, it's got the shin protection on here also as well. But look what's neat about this. It's got a velcro on here. Okay, you remove this tab, which is the uh, the zipper. Okay, and it's got a velcro on both sides. And when you open it, you have an in internal webbing on here, okay, which is going to protect you against, uh, you know, water, moisture, and such, okay? So, it, essentially, it is a waterproof boot. Uh, when, you, when you put it on, it's going to feel real snug, real nice and firm, right? You put this on here with, with the Velcro, it closes here with the Velcro, okay, and you're in like flint. Yes. I'm, I'm a little bit that old. I'm in mean, my 60 something. So, yeah, I used to watch that, that series in like Flint. Anyway, here it is. Very attractive boot. I like it. Uh, it, it contours very well. And it doesn't, it doesn't come with additional toe sliders like the other boot did. Um, so, you know, and once these wear out, you're going to have to buy other ones. Anyway, so, I, true to size. I take a 10 and a half. I wear, I wear these in 11. They fit just right, okay? Uh, I highly recommend them. They're uh, they're a little bit more comfortable than the other boot. You know, not as bulky. Don't have all that red stuff and protection and all that gizmo. You know, to make it look pretty. You know, this is just a nit grit boot for exactly for the sport riding that you want to have. Okay, so this is the one I'm keeping as opposed to the other one. This will go well with the paint scheme. I'm sorry, with the color scheme of my bike. 
Okay, uh, I, I, I would have liked this to have been gold, you know, but that's all right. Maybe I can just paint that in or something, you know, to match my bike. But anyway, this is a review of the Pro First Boot. You can get these on Amazon, you can get them on eBay. Uh, you can go directly to the website, which is a company in the UK. Uh, so, you know, just be patient because, you know, it's traveling from across the pond. So it may take a little while, okay? Uh, the fitment is fantastic. I loved it. I loved the fit. It, it didn't feel as bulky. I didn't feel like Herman Monster with some, with some monster boots. I like Herman Monster, right? You remember the monsters, right? Well, okay. So, anyway, subscribe to my channel if you like. Uh, if you're a Volkswagen enthusiast, air-cooled Volkswagen enthusiast, you'll see a lot of great stuff that I upload to, to YouTube and also my Instagram channel, which is VW Air Cool Society. And uh, anyway, for this, I recommend this boot. $81.99, you can't go wrong. For a low-budget boot, that's going to offer you really great protection for your shin, for your ankles, okay? Look, it's not it's not going to bend as as some of those cheaper boots. Uh, you know, I, I, I wear some, some, some prize from Noru, okay? But they make a, a boot that's uh, you know very inexpensive, under sixty uh, under sixty or seventy dollars, but eh, it's, it's a little too flimsy, you know. Not to knock it out, uh, not to knock down uh, no root because I wear their gloves, the gauntlet gloves. I wear their jackets also, uh, and they make some really good apparel. But as far as the boots are concerned, I recommend this one. I really highly recommend this Pro First. Okay, uh, the other uh, uh, Power Gear um, um, Motorsport boot I also recommend if you like. A little bit more protection if you want to use for motocross i think it would be great for motocross but this here for a sport bike application okay on my, like on my naked sport bike this is what i recommend pro first look for it okay ebay or amazon amazon 81.99 on ebay may range from 80 something 90 to 104 dollars okay but you can't go wrong with these boots attractive very nice very good protection okay very comfortable true to size be well and let me know if you if, if, you, if you need any further information, you want to see them on, I, you know, I, I'll take some photos and I can send them to you by, either by email or put, post it up on Instagram. Look, for, uh, look forward to hearing from you soon. This is Valentino Marquez from VW Air Cool Society. Beastie Boys, Mikey D, remember? <laughs> and the jackets from ADT Motorwear. Bossy. Uh, made in Pakistan, okay? A lot of, there's a reason for that. Look it up on Google. Why are there's the leathers good from Pakistan? They have over 800 tanneries. Anyway, be well.